Hey Enrique, this is Brandon just sending over that free short video, hopefully with some uh, things in here that you can use and uh, bring yourself in some more business and help you grow. Um, I did notice you don't have a website. All you got is a uh, Facebook page. So a couple of things you can do on here. Um, obviously keep posting um, and include in your, your business descriptions uh, keywords that people are going to type into Google uh, and what services they're going to be searching for. So a plastering job, Green Bay. Uh, drywall job here at Green Bay. Put those keywords in there and then also save these pictures. So when I go to save this picture, you'll see how it just says download. Um, if you had this picture saved with a keyword, uh, that would have came up in my in my box there. So save all your pictures that you're posting with keywords like drywall contractor Green Bay, Green Bay drywall contractor, plastering contractor Green Bay. Save them with those keywords so when people type into Google when they look for your service, it gives Google a reason to point them to your to your Facebook page. Okay, hopefully that makes sense. And then uh, when I actually go to Google and type in uh, drywall Green Bay, you'll see that the first thing that pops up here is what we call the map pack. And the way you get into this map pack is to have citations. And all a citation is, is when you get a Google My Business profile to show Google that you're a legitimate business, um, you're going to put in there your business name, your address, your phone number. Um, and then once they verify your business, any place on the web, you can duplicate that information like on an Angie's List or your Facebook uh, or a, a Yelp or a Yellow Pages. Every time you do that, that's going to get you a citation. And whoever has the most citations ends up in this map pack. Okay, so <clears throat> you'll see here that Two out of these three gentlemen don't have a website to go to. All they have is uh, is directions, right? So all they have is a Google My Business profile. So when I click on this guy here, all it brings me up is his, this is his Google My Business profile, right? So go to Google My Business, GMB, and build yourself a Google My Business profile. It's free, it's simple. And then add pictures, um, add a good description of your business, at least 500 words. And same thing here, when I go into this guy's pictures, he's missing out because I'm willing to bet he didn't save him as a keyword, right? He saved him as UV. So save your pictures on your Google My Business the same way you're going to save them on your Facebook. So that way you get picked up for keywords once again. Uh, so when people type in drywall Green Bay or plastering Green Bay, they point, you know, those customers, potential customers in your direction. So get some... Uh, Pictures updated with some keywords tagged on your Facebook. Uh, get yourself a Google My Business profile. Uh, build that out. Make sure you got keywords, good description, and then go out there and, and put your business out there on all kinds of different platforms to get yourself a bunch of citations so you can get yourself on at least this map pack. Okay. Um, if we continue to scroll down when I type in a drywall Green Bay search, you'll see that there's businesses down here underneath the map pack. These are for people that actually have a website attached to their business name and they get ranked here organically all right by how powerful their website is so these are two separate areas you know on a, on a page you got the map pack uh, takes different things to get into this versus uh, ranking organically for a website and you'll see this alpine installation drywall installation service uh, he's number one organically and i use a tool called a refs and this tool, anybody can use it. There is a monthly fee to use it, but it breaks down the person's website, shows me all their backlinks, referring domains, the keywords that they're getting picked up for. But the big one here is, is how much traffic that their website brings in every month, uh, the potential clients that they're serving and, and making money on. So um, if you were to go get a website, uh, go out there and get backlinks. And all a backlink is is any link out there on the web that people can click on and it'll send them back to your website. Uh, once again, on a website, if you build it out, make sure you got 1,500 words of content, at least on your home page. Stuff that content with buyer intent keywords. What are people searching for? That's going to send, you know, have Google send them to your website. And then, uh, you know, those keywords will get picked up and then hopefully you can see yourself with this much traffic as well. So, um, Hopefully these things were able to help you. Like I said, go into your Facebook, tag those pictures with uh, some good keyword savings. Uh, create yourself a Google My Business profile. Go out there and get some citations. Uh, if you're really looking to grow, put a website up. 
Uh, pack that thing with a lot of content and keywords. Go out there and get backlinks. Um, and then you can take this guy's spot. So you're, uh, <clears throat> you know, if you're not at least in the uh, organics, you can at least be in this map pack uh, with your Google My Business profile. So hopefully all these things help. Um, all I do ask is a line of feedback. Let me know if you got something out of this, if this was at least helpful. And uh, we'll hopefully talk to you in the future. Take care.